Hello everyone, welcome to Couple Care and my name is Vaishali Ashok. So first things first, happy new year and welcome to 2020. So for my first video of 2020, I wanted it to be 2019's uh, favorites, like the most used things in 2019 and some of my discoveries that I've absolutely been loving. So basically favorites of the year. So let's just get started with today's video. So let's start with accessories. Now under accessories, I want to talk to you guys about my earrings. Now there are three earrings that I definitely used the most last year and these are the pearl earrings so this is one of them these are the pearl earrings and i feel this goes so well with any traditional dress that i have another pearl set earrings that i did get were these ones right here uh, these are like uh, like elongated and have like pearl studded out in the front and I absolutely love how this looks this again I usually wear it with traditional outfits and then the last pearl set earrings that I do have are I do have a lot of pearls actually but these three pearls are the most worn by me last year so this is like hoops half hoops and they have pearls dangling down here i don't really remember where i got all these from because i do collect a lot of earrings and i totally lose track of where i get my earrings from so moving on to my next accessories i think this is like the best discovery of uh, 2019 and that is fake nails i did order like a bunch of different fake nails i will pop up pictures out here and i feel like they are so easy to put it on at home they're very affordable rate and i think it is a total yes from my side if you guys want to try out this i also have a video on how i apply these fake nails i will leave it in the description box below so you guys can check it out and my last um thing under the category of accessories is bags now bags are so important for me i carry my wallet my phone and all of that so this one is a simple sort of a bag i got this from miniso uh this doesn't have much detailing it's actually even open but uh, i do carry this if i'm going for like sort of like a regular basis and i think it is a year old i remember getting this when miniso first opened here in chennai um, and it's still very sturdy. I have used it very well, but I think the thread is really sturdy. I think this was this retailed for like 250 rupees. I think so. Yeah. And the second one, this is my most used and my most favorite. I usually take this when I have to go out, like for a party or a conference or something like that. And uh, no matter what my outfit is, this is what I take. That is why I picked up this particular color. All right, let's go up to the next category, which is my most worn clothing item. And I will say it is definitely jeans because I cannot survive without a jean. Like even if I have to dance on stage, I wear a jean. If I have to uh, wear kurti under i prefer a jean over a legging any day i don't know why it's always like that for me and the best jean is i think this is also one of the best discoveries of this year is this jeans right here it's by code the company code and this is a size 30 and these have that very hugging material which i absolutely love this really hugs your leg and make it look really really sexy so that is why i really like this a lot and the zip on this side really helps to tuck your tummy in <laughs> if you know what i mean so yeah i would really recommend you guys to go try it on at least i got it in lifestyle next up for body we have mists body mists now my favorite favorite perfume of this year is paris hilton's uh, perfume this one was actually gifted to me by my brother when he went to us he got me this and this smells so good like this is so strong as well this lasts the entire day this is another bottle that he <laughs> he got it for me because the old one got over so yeah this is really long lasting and it, this um the smell is long lasting and this lasts you pretty good as well so my next category is hair uh now if you guys know anything about my hair i have the most driest brittle hair ever it's just how my hair is and i really need to tame it very very well take a lot of good care and extra care and you know go that extra mile for my hair to look really good another amazing discovery of this year is this one right here this is l'oreal's rapid reviver deep conditioning it really does what it says i did try it out once and i could see the difference instead of using conditioner i use this and unlike the conditioner it doesn't need any leave-in time you can just wash it off immediately i think if any of you are suffering from dry hair like me then you should totally go for this next up again this is something that i use specifically to tackle my dryness of my hair so it is a hair serum 
serum which I got this year. This is the System Professionals Lux Oil. Uh, this is definitely on the pricier side and you guys can see I've almost used it. I did get this in the beginning of the year when I wanted to try out like a new serum and I use this every time I wash my hair which is basically twice a week and um, I would put up my hair care routine and you guys can see how much of it do I use every single time and I still have this much left um, And this is really good if you have extremely dry hair like you will really thank yourself to get this and uh, Definitely on the pricier side, but I think it's totally worth it if you are suffering from like very very dry hair Now the last thing that I have is face it the first thing is face wash and it is this one right here This is by Himalaya's neem face wash. I don't know how many bottles I've honestly gotten because um I use this all the time obviously I use it twice every single day so now that we did face wash let's do face scrub my favorite favorite face scrub is this one right here is biotex bio papaya it is a revitalizing tan removal serum. I scrub at least um, at least once a week if not twice a week twice a week is good but i do at least once a week let's do lips first nude lipstick now personally i never understood the concept of nude why people like nude lipstick because it's practically nude so i never really understood uh, the concept of nude until i recently very very recently got it um my mom got it to me as a gift so uh this is this one right here this is nika's wonder puff cushion lipstick this is in the shade Bucka buttercup it's the one that i have on my lips right now only after i got it and used it i realized how how good it is like you guys have no idea it is so good so heavy on your eyes you could totally match it up with a nude shade and you are all good to go now the last thing that i have for eyeshadow are these swiss beauties liquid um i don't know what these are called i think these are liquid liquid eyeshadows this is more on the glittery silvery side looks really pretty so this one is called 02 diamond dust 03 champagne you don't even need to add anything on your eyes you could just like pop this all over your lid and maybe smudge it on the crease a bit and it would look so gorgeous and these are very inexpensive as well i think these are each for 200 i think i got these on nika Maybelline's Total Temptation Mascara. This is my favorite mascara. You don't need false lashes if you have this mascara. And you guys should try it out if you are looking for mascara that is easily removable, makes your eyes look flawlessly beautiful without lashes. You guys should totally try this out. So yeah, that is it for today's video. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. I definitely had a lot of fun making this video. So these are my 2019 favorite favorite products of the year i really like all of these products i definitely tried and tested them out that is why i'm sharing it with you guys and also make sure to subscribe to my channel before you guys leave and take care and i'll see you next time bye